So this is her third day spot riding lesson. So she's so excited. So we'll see what she's going to do today. With you, I can be sad with you. He was used to having his mane and tail dyed pink all the time. He was just like, get over it, lady. <laughs> Bless his heart. Oh, you get stuck with me today. Miss Aaron got kicked out. Oh, you guys out. got rain here. Well, no. I got bit once, too, by my dad when I was a kid, about my daughter's age there. Red wing. Cold Stay away from the coat. She had a baby, a foal. Oh. And... He was gone at work, and my brother and I went in there and was fooling around with the motor. The best horse. I mean, she bit hard. The best horse will bite you over a baby. I had an old pony that I loved. Wow, good girl, baby. Look at you. By herself. So today, this is her third time on her lesson for horseback riding. So they're going to do this lesson today. One live, go by yourself. Oh Woo! Go by I'm so Party time. Nervous. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm nervous. <laughs> my God, you your daughter driving a horse by herself, honey. <laughs> Honey, now that's a big girl. Wow, wow, look at you. Shippy, you got a good apple today. Solo. <laughs> that's awesome, Lib. Awesome, baby. Proud of you. Oh my god, I can't believe she's grown so fast. Our girl's growing up. Check that out, man. I know. Eight years old on her own. Check that out. Whee! <laughs> That's what she wanted, boy. <laughs> she's lazy. <laughs> oh my god, she's so funny. The Oh. <laughs> but she's in heaven right now, I can tell you that. Look at that. She's, she's a big girl riding by herself in a big horse. Sure about your good equipment. You gonna make her go on each side of the things there. See, look at that. Wow, Lib. Look at something. That's awesome, Lib. We need to take Cheapy home with us. <laughs> I was 13 for our first guy on a horse. Is that awesome? Wow. I remember when she came home from the hospital. <laughs> Seems like yesterday, now she's riding the 
Nine hundred pound horse. <laughs> you know she's happy. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> You think she's got the world on fire now, boy. She's funny. <laughs> Not her stop. She's lazy. <laughs> I know you're happy now. <laughs> wow. Oh, it's a pool bending. I see. She didn't get it, she? Yeah, I don't want a, a biting a kicking horse. I like a horse like 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 her. Oh. Oh. So proud of you, Lip. Totally awesome, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Happy parents. Big times up. Happy Big daddy. thumbs up. <laughs> I was 13 before I ever got around a horse. Really? Oh, yeah. My God, she just ate. Teenager. She, was, she was just eight. Yeah, I got my first BB gun at 13, and 22 at 13, and no, I got my BB gun at 10, I think, and put my 22 at 13, and my first horses. 13. It might have been 12. I think it was 12 when I got a horse. About that size there. Good girl. My Look at her. Mare, dollar black mare. Look at her. She's just a natural. You rule, girl. She'll have you barrel racing in about a month. <laughs> Say. We have to do, we have to get the skill before we go to the speed. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. What? What's he say? Mostly the kids just want to jump in the horse and run. She wants what? Some of the kids just want to jump on the horse and just do a run, like run. What's the purpose in the poles? When we go to club, these are spaced 21 feet apart. When we go to saddle club, and what we do, what we're doing now is we're just ingraining this pattern in this horse and into this kid. When is we this, get to this is a big, big enough for uh, the barrel racing? Oh yeah, barrels? I do. I do that too. Yeah. But that horse, believe it or not, is a fire-breathing dragon. When I take her into a stadium, when I take her into a stadium, she knows her job. Oh, smart. We're, 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 we're so proud of her. I mean. Smart horse. She Were you that young uh, on a horse? I was four. Huh? I was four. Four? Four. I, I was, I, tw I thought it was 13, but I guess it was 12. I got my BB gun at 12, my 22 at 13, and, I, and my first horse, I think, at uh, 12. I started riding Black was Beauty. Four. She was uh, about that size. You did awesome. I don't remember no one teaching me to ride, but I guess someone did. Turn, turn, turn. Bad a girl. Bad a girl. We really appreciate you guys doing this. Oh, I, I love the kids. Are you going to help us find an Appaloosa? Ooh, Appaloosa huh? I said, I'll, I'll do my best. Fine, I'll give you a finder's fee. And then Appaloosa? Straight down. You're doing good. We want to we wanna border here when you can and find us a good horse like that. I'll buy that one, but I know you won't sell her, right? Nope. <laughs> she really wants an Appaloosa. Don't ask me why. 
I usually tell my clients I find them with my heart, not my eyes. I mean, I check feet and I check eyes and I check all that good yeah. stuff, but the red horse in the upper field up here. Mm-hmm. She ran an action here. You guys are I, I took Fred and Fred was a cruelty seizure. And I fell in love with Fred and never rode him and fell in love with him. Mm -hmm. I rode him one time. He is perfect Skippy Peanut Butter for a kid. I mean, he wouldn't run if his tail was on fire. Oh my goodness. He would <laughs> bless his heart. He's just, he's old slow pokey Joe and that's what I need. <laughs> slow pokey Joe. Yeah. It's always so quiet here too. I like it here. It feels like I'm in pine top. Honey, hmm? it feels like I'm in pine top. Well, it's like in the country, but yeah, we're, in, I guess we're in the city, but it's like in the country. Yeah, oh, we're just you're doing good, kiddo. I told her every time we'll learn a new game. We have all kinds of different games. Right? She really enjoys this, though, and it's. Well, the only reason I make her go around is to break up the monotony for the horse. I must yeah, prefer. The horse gets kind of tired of doing this. <laughs> well, I grew up with this, and I must prefer this rather than having a. Turn, turn, turn! You forgot your turn, baby girl. There you go. Oh, that was a good save. Like I said, she's a sweet old horse with a kid on her. She'll plug along like an old dead dog all day. And like... Have you ever been to the mall and seen about a pack of kids run together with about thirty different colors in their hair and all that? See. This is much, much better, okay? Oh, yes. totally. <laughs> so, Mr. G Mr. Dad's going with this, all right? <laughs> I tell people all the time, horses Open cheap. checkbook, okay? Horses. Daddy, Dad's going with this. <laughs> Open checkbook now. <laughs> I, I see those kids and I'm like, uh, no, that ain't gonna, that ain't gonna work. Not on my watch. I tell them all the time, horses are a whole lot cheaper than boys. <laughs> Earrings <laughs> hanging down here that look like a bull ring, you know? Uh -huh. I'm like, uh, no, we'll go with the horse. Life's Doing good. Nice, oh my goodness. You look good, Lib. Bless her heart. This morning she like baptized me. I was like, gee, thanks. Is this what she ate? No, they don't eat that. That's ragweed. Oh, okay. Nothing eats that. Clovers? Eat grass. Oh, you mean the three... Three. Oh, clovers. Yeah. Clovers, um, clovers what makes them slobber. Oh. Hey, I hate to, I hate to do this to my wife because she's shy, but this is her birthday today. Oh, honey. Birthday. <laughs> Thank you. The little girl I had this morning, it was her birthday too. Wow. <laughs> You have a yesterday. popular birthday. <laughs> it is. We took her yesterday to Red Lobster. Mm -hmm. And uh, today, uh, just cooked at home. Nothing wrong with that. My daughter snuck in the store and got some, well, I went with her and got some flowers on a card for her yesterday, some chocolates. <laughs> she kept saying last night, Mommy, don't go to my bedroom, okay? Every time I go in the bedroom, doing Mommy, don't good. go to my bedroom. You're doing real good. Turn, turn, turn. Girl. That's a good horse, huh? Yeah, I love that old horse. I originally bought her for my daughter. Oh, for your daughter? When, when the horse was two years old, I purchased her from a friend of mine. Uh huh. And I brought her home. I, now she wasn't broke. I put a saddle on her, put a bridle on her, you know, put a bit on her, and took her out there. Straight down. Straight this way, baby girl. <laughs> And the horse like, the horse make up your mind. <laughs> I don't have horse insurance, so I don't want no body damage. <laughs> she, oh my God. she got on this horse and she rode it for like 10 minutes. It didn't know nothing. Oh. And she looked at me and snarled her nose and she said, well, it's kind of below my standards. I said, get your butt off my horse. That's my horse. Oh, below my standards. This is the day you've been wanting, Lib. There you go. You real. So, uh, I said, get off my horse. That's my horse now. <laughs> so I made her get off. And let me tell you, every year we had to go to state show, her horse, something was always wrong with her horse. And she'd have to come ask me for my horse. I'd make her ask. And she's like, Mom, can I borrow your horse? And I'm like, oh, you mean you want to borrow below my needs and below my standards? <laughs> and she's like, Mom, that's so embarrassing. I'm like, well, it's true. <laughs> oh, my God. She asked me one time, she was like, when something happens to you, can I have your horse? And I said, no. <laughs> and she's like, why? I was like, I told Stephen if he ever got rid of my two horses, I'd come back and haunt him. <laughs> and I would, and he knows it. But he's not about to get rid of them two horses. <laughs> that a girl. Oh. You're doing good. Oh, what happened to Pull. the horse? Pull your, there you go. <laughs> Shaw is a size two. That was one thing that was really a bitter pill to take, was having to have somebody else shoe my horse for the first time. I Do you cried. have the horse guy comes and he shods these out here now or something? Turn, turn to your left. 
Turn hard, 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 hard. You can make it. Kick, kick, kick. I'm a there you go. Oh, there you go. You got it. You made it. <laughs> Actually, I have two horseshoers. I have a lady that comes and does chippy and so They do the customers out here too. Yep. And uh, I've got a gentleman who does the big horse. He does all my jerks. She does all the easy ones. So you got a guy that does everybody pretty much? I got two of them that do everybody. They do a good job, it looks like. I like him for the bad ones. If well, they, you know what you're doing, so if you like him, I like him, you know. He <laughs> he has the patience of Joe. He will stand there. And, he argued with that horse for two hours to put his shoes on. <sighs> the second time he came, it only took him an hour and a half. He stood there like a good boy. <laughs> I was like, I'm glad you can arm wrestle because I sure wouldn't. Last time I had Arnold, it was like $55 for shoes. What is it now? Um, for him to be done all 90 or 100 or... It's 100 for the big guy. <laughs> I figured it'd be double. For That's... her, I get all the way around on her, but Jill's pricing is Every different. And six, for that eight one, weeks, something like that? Eight weeks. Eight weeks. I do her, and she's $55 for mine because it's a much smaller horse. That one has to have custom shoes. So, honey, every eight weeks. Honey, I got a lot of bite, them, honey. Uh, you have her. Uh, honey, hold on, honey. I got bite, honey. Uh, sho shoes on them. They trim their feet, and they clean the bottoms out, and all that it's stuff. It's quite an ordeal. What do they call it? We had one once got bad. I didn't catch it in time. Uh, thrush. What do they call that when the, the, the hoof gets bad in there? Uh, thrush. Huh? Thrush? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, that was a mess. Turn, turn, turn. That a girl. Boy, Lib, you're doing so good. You are. My money says we're a good student. Stay off the sidewalk. <laughs> I tell them keep it between the ditches. <laughs> oh my God. That'd be the white pole. <laughs> Straight down the hill. There you go. I joke with them all the time. You guys are great. I'm glad we found you. I've always enjoyed the tour. My brother told me one time, he said, You're the luckiest person I know. I said, How do you do that? I work seven days a week. He said, Yeah, but you love what you do. The rest of us suckers just go to work. <laughs> you're having a blast, aren't you, Lib? Yeah. <laughs> I know you are. I know you. <laughs> it's like she won the lottery, boy. She's on her own. Well, I saw her the last time, and I didn't understand why Miss Erin wouldn't take her off the lead line. I was like, she's big enough and old enough, and she can hold that horse. Chippy's not bad. She's been watching mm -hmm. YouTube's of horses and <laughs> how to do this and that, and. She's really excited. Turn down That's the hill. Good. a girl. I don't know what better quality time you could give a child than a horse, you know? Yep. I had to laugh. A friend of mine, her two granddaughters came to visit uh, back in June, or no, July. And uh, these kids, one come from Texas, one come from North Carolina. Ooh. And, I mean, two kids have come to see grandma. That's a long ways to come see grandma. And grandma has two horses, but she needed three. So I, I said, well, I'll tell you what. You send me the little girl, because she's 10. I said, and I'll give her a riding lesson in the morning while you and the older granddaughter go trail riding. So we did that for four or five, well, four days. On the fifth day, I said, I'll tell you what. I'm going to pony you on my horse. I'll, I'll have a safety line, but I'll, I'll take all y'all riding. So mm -hmm. I took them all for a big trail ride. They thought they were King Kong on crack. King Kong. King Kong on crack. I like that. So Saturday. I gotta, I, gotta, I gotta remember that one. King Kong on crack. Oh my God. So Saturday rolls around and I tell them, I'm like, okay, we're gonna go to Saddle Club. So you guys are gonna be out late tonight. And they're like, late? I'm like, yeah, like, yeah. I gotta remember. A lot of mamas and daddies out here with having good quality time with their kids. I saw a lot of people who didn't know these two little girls and they cheered for them just as good as they did the friends they've had for years. He said, this was not at all what I had envisioned, but it sure was fun. <laughs> it they is. got their little ribbons, oh and they placed God. in a lot of their classes that they did. They had a ball. And uh, Sweet. Miss Dolly told me, she said, Miss Angel, what do I owe you for this? And I said, nothing. And she said, why? And I said, because they'll always remember coming to Grandma's house that summer. This will be etched in their brains forever. Mm -hmm. And they'll always remember coming here and having so much fun with you. Mm -hmm. And I get to be a part of that. It so is. it's all good. <laughs>
I took a bunch of kids one year, a bunch of inner city kids, didn't even know how to ride. I took a, about five kids, couldn't even ride. <laughs> we had a good time. <laughs> That's awesome, Lib. You're doing good, baby girl. You got this down to a T. We're going to play games that take precision, though. We're going to get oh, so I remember when you came home from the hospital with a baby, she seemed like yesterday. Now you're on a big horse by yourself. So when she's go ready to do the trail walk? Well, when she wants to go, when she gets good enough that I can trust her, um, what, the way I do trail rides is I ride Chippy and I put them on Soco. Uh -huh. Soco is a little bit slower than Chippy. She's a little bit bigger, only two inches bigger, but just a little bit slower. Can we go? Like, just walk? On foot? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The trails are like that, yeah. They're yeah. beautiful. And, uh, Honey, are you ready? I can take her. For what? For walk trail. And, walk where? Uh, go with them. Huh? I can, uh, when she's I'll ready. Take, when I'll she's take. ready. Oh, yeah, whatever. Follow the instructors here. Follow, I, uh, follow the leader. It's been too long since <laughs> I pulled with this stuff. I want her done right. <laughs> that a girl. Doing good. I'm not teaching her to drive the car. She is. No, we're going to walk. You're not going to drive. Today? Not today. No, not no. today. She's not ready yet. What do you mean by walk? Like we walk in the trail by barefoot. Walk foot. Barefoot? Walk foot. Because I only have two horses. <laughs> I can't take groups anymore. <laughs> I usually just you take You mean like just walk around with her? Oh, is that I, what you mean? Or? It's, a, it's actually a great big huge trail. And it's got a lot you of You talking about that place over here you're telling us about? Peeler Park. Yeah. So are you going? I'm going. I'm going to walk too with them. When? When she's ready, hon. Huh? The oh, time. Yeah, whenever she, whenever <laughs> when she's ready. Time. Oh yeah, of course, yeah. Okay. And she's going to help help find a, a horse, hon. Huh? Ah, okay. You're riding the horse. I walk. <laughs> She'll find something. You're a good horse, Chippy. That's awesome. I love that horse. Very gentle. You got an apple, after. <laughs> she looks for stuff. She does. She's like, what you got? <laughs> well, none, of, none of your children, uh, your three, are really into horses, huh? Nope. And your hubby's not, yeah. Nope. My husband's never ridden. He hadn't ridden since we were teenagers. Out of my... My ex four grown, there's only one that's into him, and my daughter, the sons never did take to him, never did. It tickles when they do that. I think it's fun. She's looking for Soko. But this one sure, sure is exciting. Well, you rubbed that she... one hard. You didn't knock it over, but you sure rubbed it hard. <laughs> turn, turn, turn. And don't don't turn, pull turn. hard. It tickles. <laughs> I'm sure she ever went to horse shows or something. She'd meet friends and stuff. And oh, my daughter, we had friends that we we knew. Everything, for years. yeah. We were standing. Uh, my daughter was in one class. I was braiding her horse for the next class. Go down to the left now. Straight down. There you go. And